welcome back to my channel. So obviously by today's title, it's gonna be all about my dog, El Capitan. If you guys asked to see what it was like to own a Rottweiler on a day-to-day -day basis, um, I will show you guys the good and the bad sides. So I keep it real with you as always. And I wanna let you guys know that everybody trains their dog a little bit differently. So the way I train it might not work out for you, your family, but this is just what, what works out for me. Um, I hate long intros, so I'm gonna cut right to the chase. I eventually do want to get a series going of like what I do with him when I go out of town, how he interacts with other dogs. So please comment below if you guys are interested in these Capitan videos because I had a great time filming them. Um, like I said, I'm going to cut right to the video and I love you guys and I'll see you next time. Bye. So we are an early household. Our morning starts around 5 a.m. That's when Capitan will go out to use the restroom. He usually comes back and we sleep in till 6 and then our day will get started. Good boy. Did you go potty? Okay. Did you go potty? <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> go inside. Put your little butt inside. Capitan is pretty much my shadow. He will follow me all around the house when I'm doing my chores. My morning is usually just opening up all the shutters and also turning on the lights for all my other animals. Along with this dry kibble, I do make Capitan a homemade meal. I will link that all in my description box i have a video of how to make homemade dog food he absolutely loves it his coat's amazing so highly recommend it Yay! super important to have your dog digest that food so i mainly just have capitan lay down and chill for about an hour before i let him wild out and run in the backyard just to make sure he digests all that food No, he's not howling for no reason. The sound of a siren triggers him and he's been doing this ever since he was a puppy. He even does it in the car sometimes, which is hilarious. Yes, Capitan is the biggest sweetheart you'll ever meet, but it still does not get out of his blood that he is a guard dog. He does not like people in his front yard, especially when he knows his dad is gone. He just is on guard 24 seven, especially with the front door. He just thinks he needs to protect and guard his mom. And you know what? That's what he is, so I don't stop him. And then we'll have moments like these where he thinks he is a three pound chihuahua and wants to lay in my lap and play with his little unicorn. Fun fact, Capitan has quite a toy collection. Capitan does not destroy his toys, so he has accumulated quite a few and we don't get rid of them. We just keep them in this nice toy box, which he likes to uh, take out and make me re-put them away all the time. <laughs> Even though Capitan is a short-haired dog, I am constantly sweeping and mopping and swiffering at my house all the time um, just because he does shed hair. He's a big dog and especially right now in the summertime 
we are shedding so i try to brush them as much as i can um capitana absolutely hates the vacuum hates the broom that just goes to show you how much of a big baby he really is <laughs> Loki did not want to show you this, but I want to keep it real on my channel. This is how dirty my floors get from having a Rottweiler. Overall, Capitan is an extremely clean dog, and he's very low maintenance when it comes to grooming. I do just take him baths myself and brush him out. He does not go to the groomers, but yeah, taking him bath is a whole other deal. We'll do a video on that later. I personally do not take Capitan on walks around in the neighborhood. I mean, this boy weighs the same amount that I do. So we are so blessed that we have such a huge backyard that he just fully takes advantage of. Um, he's running around like a psycho 24 seven in this backyard. So this is how we usually exert most of our energy. <laughs> when it gets super hot, we will bust out the kiddie pool. When I leave, Capitan pretty much gets the free range of the whole house. He is a really good boy. He does not get into anything. He doesn't chew anything. I trust him, so he gets to just take over the whole house when I'm gone. <laughs> back from running errands i usually just spend all afternoon playing ball with him i will work on my garden he will just be playing around so this is the best time for him to start winding down before dinner now that's time for dinner i usually just warm it up for a minute and he is always of course right by my side waiting for his food to get made um he is such a good boy, he will just wait here. He knows when the beeper goes off in the microwave that it's time to eat. After dinner, Capitan knows it's time to start winding down. I will shut all the shutters, turn off all the lights for the rest of the animals. He hops on my bed and he knows it's just time to start relaxing. Capitan is an absolute sweetheart. He will cuddle with me, but he is also a guard dog. It runs in his blood, so he is always going to be on guard and protective. That's just a trait that is in these Rottweilers. Um, I love talking about him and doing this vlog. I kind of want to do a series. Let me know down below if you guys are interested in seeing more of uh, him going to his grandma's house when he has when I go out of town, um, him interacting with other dogs. I think it'd be a lot of fun. But thank you guys again for even checking out this video. Please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and I will see you next time. Bye.